as you can see in the user chart there is also on the right side there is also a column of safety below that there are three options safe depth and dangerous by default it is always on safe so there you can make your text line circle areas text everything this depth column is used for con making a contour for example normally it is generally used for to make a contour so for example if you have a contour of uh, if you get a safety value in from your calculation you get a safety value of 6 meter safety depth but in the agdes normally we do not take we, it cannot take 6 meter safety contour so it will select a higher setting which will be 10 meters but now if you want to make your own safety contour so you can click right click on that depth column and then on the right side you can see it is written in the box the box will be now it is uh, unedited so then now you cannot edit so when you once you click on the depth then you can see the box will appear and you can edit inside the box where meter is written so you can write whatever value you want and then you can select anything line for example and then you can make your own line and that will be selected for 10 meter 6 meters so here you can see i've clicked on depth and i've uh, selected the area column on the left side and then i'm making an area and then you can see as soon as i finished with making my area the default value al already went to save in the safety column you can see it automatically went to save now you can see if i'm making again a line if i selected line now and i'm making the line in the user chart it is made on safe because it it went to safe by default so every time if you want to make for depth or dangerous you have to select it and as soon as you finish with making your line or area it will automatically shift to safe because by default it always goes to safe and if you select dangerous over here your anti-grounding function will work so for example if you selected dangerous then you can write a depth over here if you want to write and then after selecting dangerous you are making a line for example from the user chart if your ship and if your ship will pass through this you will get an alarm or if your safety set if your uh, this anti-grounding function will work and uh, so basically your in your look ahead function if uh, the safety sector and vector if your look ahead function it is there whenever your look ahead function will enter into this area you will get an alarm